Well, welcome. In this video lecture, we are looking at the book Think Python, How to Think Like a Computer Scientist. We're looking at the second edition. The authors are Alan, Jeffrey, and Chris. I'm going to be doing video lectures. My name is Arthur Solomon. I'm going to be working with you throughout these videos. Thank you. Exercise 1.2. We have three questions. How many seconds are in the 42 minute, 42 seconds. How many miles are there in 10 kilometers? And the third question is, if you're running a 10 kilometer race in 42 minutes and 42 seconds, what is your average pace? We're looking for miles in minutes and seconds. What is your average speed in miles per hour? So let's go ahead and jump in and get these solved. All right, so first and foremost, 42 minutes plus 42 seconds. So we are going to do 42 times 60. That will give us how many seconds there are in 42 minutes. We're going to add 42. That would be there are 225, sorry, there's 2,562 seconds in 42 minutes and 42 seconds. Question two, how many miles are in a 10 uh, kilometer, a kilometer? So what we can do is we can do, I'm gonna do double parentheses. Actually, I'm just gonna do a single parentheses. We have 10 kilometers and we want to divide that by 1.61 because there are 1.61 kilometers in a mile. There are 6.21118 miles in 10 kilometers. So how many miles are there in 10 kilometers? The answer is 6.21118. So let's move on to question number three. All right, so the next part, if you're running a 10 kilometer race and you have 42 minutes, 42 seconds, what is your average pace? Time per miles, minutes, and seconds. And what is the average speed in miles per hour? So what we're gonna do is we're gonna take our distance, 6.21, I'm gonna copy this, paste it, I'm going to divide that by our total seconds. This provides us our total time per seconds in miles. So this is time per, uh, uh, this is time miles per second. Now, if we want to convert this to our minutes, times 60, that's how many minutes, miles per minutes we're doing. If we want to look at miles per hour, there are 60 minutes in a mile. Oh, I did my math wrong. Paste times 60. We are roughly doing 8.73 miles per hour. So there's multiple ways of doing this. You can also do parentheses if you uh, wish. We could also do our first problem inside one set of parentheses, our second problem in the second set of parentheses, and our third problem in the third set of parentheses. So let's see if this yields these same results. And it does. So it really all depends on how we want to organize this to answer exercise 1.2's questions. Thank you. That concludes this chapter. If you have any questions or concerns, please feel free to reach out and leave me a comment or a question. I'll try to get those answered as quickly as I can. Again, thank you, and I look forward to working with you in later modules.